Hello with one more video with Linux Mint 19.3 and today we will talk about fonts. It will have three small sections. One of them will be how to install a single font, how to install the Microsoft fonts because a little later we will communicate with the Windows users and how to install a batch of many fonts at the same time. Let's start with the single font. If we have a uh, one simple font and we want just to install it we just have to go on the top of the fonts click twice with the mouse and it will pop up a windows with a button green button install if it's already installed the button will be gray out and it will says installed simple as that now because uh, a lot of people in the world using microsoft Windows or you like to you have to use uh, fonts which they belong to uh, Windows Microsoft sorry so the easiest way is to go to software manager just type Microsoft and uh, this is the program which you have to install this program will install most common Microsoft Windows fonts and many documents are with them. So we just click the button install. Right now I will not do that. I will make another example how you can install many fonts at the same time. Navigate to the folder where you actually store your fonts. I have one with, uh, with many, many fonts, so you cannot just click one by one. The easiest way is just copy paste them. So select them all. Click uh, copy and we have to navigate to one particular directory where the Linux Mint stores their fonts, uh, its fonts. So navigate to user share fonts and because I will copy two type fonts TTF, so I'll go to folder to type. We have to open the last folder like root to be able to paste them because only the root has permission to paste any files inside. So I suggest you to create a folder. So if you're working with uh, Adobe, you can just create Adobe. If you have some Microsoft uh, fonts, you can create a folder Windows and paste them inside to let the uh, operational system knows that you just paste new fonts you have to execute uh, one command and that command will actually refresh uh, the library for for fonts and from this moment your linux mint and the application will know and be able to use these fonts depends of how many fonts already exist it will take a little more time if you have a lot of fonts inside so we just have to wait uh, the finish here it is and we can try to see if they are available I will try with the LibreOffice um, this is like Microsoft Office uh, I will use Writer which is analog of Microsoft Word Okay, so here they are, Arial Times New Roman, which is Microsoft Windows uh, fonts. This is everything. Thank you to be with me and see you next time.